She's got some pickup now. Oh yeah. What gear? We're in second gear. She feels like she's gaining a lot of speed. Let's go uh, let's try third gear. No, 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 no! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of My Summer Car. And today, got a couple things to take care of. Obviously, you don't see the car anymore, and I finally took it over to the repair shop. It's actually ready to go. I went ahead and got a lot of things done to it. We got the wheel alignment, we've got the engine tuning, we've got the really gonna bother me during my intro. You know what? It's probably more poo wells. I am absolutely sick and tired of these poo wells. What do you want? No. I'm done. No more poo. Yeah, I've done nothing but poo wells in between episodes, so I had enough. I went ahead and ordered those parts that we, uh, well, we ordered them last episode, but I went ahead and picked them up. So, as you can see, we've got some racing parts to install on the car. So yeah, we're going to go pick up the car from the repair shop and go ahead and turn it into a racing beast. You know, I'm actually really kind of nervous to see the car. I hope it runs good. I mean, I hope the engine tuning and all that was worth it. Uh, I did change the final gear. I think I changed it like 4100 or 4. 100. I don't know. We can always change it again. Uh, see how it runs. Uh, I want a fast rally car. At least that's the uh, whole point because I do want to actually run those races. I'm probably going to crash the car in the process, but that doesn't matter. But yeah, a lot of people are probably going to question the whole fact that I did actually pay to get the body repaired. Uh, some people are like, well, you just need to delete the mesh or edit the mesh file or do something like that. But I went ahead and actually paid for it. Uh, maybe I won't do it next time if we crash it again because that was extremely expensive. Like 8000 Yeah, I don't want to see another poo well again. I'm sick and tired of pumping that. I'm, no more. Alright, here we are and that's not my car. What the heck? Did they repaint? Oh, I guess with the body repair he's repainted part of it. Okay. Wow, it's like primer or something. But okay, let's go ahead and turn this off here. Uh, yeah, I guess we're gonna leave the van here because I don't, I don't need it. And, oh, look at it. It is beautiful. Look at the body. It's all shaped right. Ah, oh, look at that. That is amazing. Now, hopefully she actually runs. Uh, that's the one thing I'm a bit worried about, but as far as the body, I'm really impressed. And what are you looking at? This is my car. Now, let me bask in its beauty. Uh, let's see. Do I need to do anything? Or, I'm assuming we're all taken care of. Now, this guy does offer paint jobs, too. So we might do that in the future if you guys have a suggestion for paint. Uh, I don't even know what colors he has available. Let's go ahead and look at that real quick. And then we're going to crank that car up and run home. Hello. Uh, let's see. Uh, paint job, paint job. Yeah, you can do factory colors. Can you please hush while I'm trying to explain this? Uh, regular colors, they have like a metal color. Custom painted by the artist. Oh, that's expensive. Okay, we're going to have to pump a lot of poo to get that. So yeah, we might do that if you guys have any suggestions. I know you can also import... Can you please stop? But yeah, I know you can also import uh, paint jobs or somehow get custom ones. So we might do that too. But uh, yeah, here's the moment of truth. Let's go ahead and hop in here. I'm a little nervous. Uh, everything looks in order in here. Okay. Let's go ahead and close the door. He better have left me some fuel in here. There we go. Oh, the door still doesn't shut that good. Yeah, I need to get those extra gauges. They're going to set on there. And that's one thing I didn't order like a dum-dum, so... I don't know. <gasps> Ooh, hear that? Ooh, okay. She's running? She's not sputtering? Does she still die? Oh, this is nice. Okay, let's, uh, let's try to get her home in one piece here. And then we'll start working on some new parts and... Oh, yeah. Oh, there's no pool anymore! Oh, this is fantastic! It doesn't pull to the left and to the right like it did before. We've got that. Oh, this is gonna be great. She's got some pickup now. Oh, yeah. What gear? We're in second gear. She feels like she's gaining a lot of speed. Let's go, uh, let's try third gear. No, 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 no! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, my God. Are, are you kidding me? You're kidding me, right? What have I done? I got like a quarter mile from the shop and I've already flipped it? Are you kidding me? Ugh, closed door. How bad is she? Not too bad, no? 
Can I get her over on her lid without destroying her? Oh, this is so embarrassing. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Like that, that is embarrassing. That is, that's terrible. Come on, push over. I need you to flip over. Oh, maybe we can flip it easier this way. It looks like it's gonna tip over. I can't believe I just did that. Like I just spent all this money. You know what, we're deleting the mesh file next time. That is a bunch of crap. Come on, tip over. I need you to flip. How do we flip you? No, don't. Oh, he's probably actually laughing at me now. Come on, come on. Oh, there we go. Oh, that is embarrassing. <laughs> like, really? What the heck? Uh, how bad is it? How bad is it? Okay. Uh, well. Well, okay, the, the passenger seat, it's kind of forward. I'm not really worried about it. I'm gonna get rid of that one. Uh, there's a ding by the fuel cap. There's a ding on the roof. Uh, is that it? You know, that actually wasn't terrible. I'm not gonna get that repaired again. I'm not paying for that. Uh, I think I can repair the body parts myself with the uh, sledgehammer. I don't know what happened to the seat there. That seat's gonna get removed anyways. That's gonna be a, it's not gonna be a thing anymore. Now, question is, she was running when she was upside down. Does she still crank? Oh, okay, we were gonna putt home. That is embarrassing. Well, we're almost home now. It does run a lot better now, even though I flipped it on the way here. Oh, don't do it again. Come on. Yeah, I'm watching the uh, the fuel mixture seems to be like right where it needs to be. Everything seems to be good with it. Now, I'm a little embarrassed by the uh, body damage that we've just received. But, you know what? We're going to paint it again. We're going to paint it red. And then uh, we'll go back if we need to go back and paint it uh, one of the metallic color colors or metal colors. Uh, whatever we might do over there, I don't know. That was kind of expensive anyways, but, uh, yeah. Let's see. Let's look at her again. You know, it's not too bad. We can manage this. Uh, but it's time to go ahead and try to install some of these parts. Now, I can't guarantee I'm going to get all these installed today because there's quite a bit to do. Uh, that Hopefully, that'll buff out. Uh, I'm also going to remove some parts. We're going to shed some weight here. Obviously, that seat's already damaged. So, we're going to get rid of that seat. We're going to get rid of the back seat. Oh, that's a little worse than it looked like earlier. We're gonna be okay. <laughs> we're gonna be okay. All right, we got some work to do here, so we're gonna drink some beer. Let's go ahead and toss that away. Now, I think I'm gonna repaint the car. Hmm, do I wanna go with a different color than what I had before? You know, I really kinda like the red body with red panels. It kinda represents the channel. So, we're gonna go with that on the body, but we might change something else around. Uh, let's see, spray paint that back. Come on. Yep, come on. I don't know how long this takes. There we go. All right, we've got our old turd back. So we've got that. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and start with some of the parts. I'm going to do the, uh, we'll call them the uh, cosmetic parts first. I don't even know how to get half this crap on. Uh, what is this? This is a spoiler. Can we paint this? Because that is an ugly color. Uh, let's see. That is that dented? No, that's, that's fine, I think. Uh, I'm assuming this goes on just like right here in the back. Uh, there we go. Now here's an important question. Can we spray paint these parts? Uh, we're about to put, I like that little uh, grill. It's like a window grill. That's gonna go on the back. Uh, I don't know if that's gonna hinder our vision going out the back, but I don't know. Guess it's not really a big deal. Now let's see, can we paint these? Yes, we can. Oh, look at that. You can already tell this car is just so aerodynamic. Uh, we gotta rip that back bumper off. I think I've got a bumper or I've got something. Uh, yeah, that's a bumper. Let's see more cosmetic crap. I better keep that. Uh, let's keep this out there because I'm gonna need that uh, How do these do hickeys go on? This is the fender flare right rear. Okay, this stuff looks bent too. It's like what did they do when they shipped this? Uh, let's see what it looks like on the car right rear fender flare boom Okay, fender flares are on now question is should we blend it with the body or you know what those might actually look good if they're black I don't know. Let's try that real quick. Let's get our spray can here Can we spray paint this come on? Uh, let's see hmm. I Don't know this car looks like a turd either way So it's like we're just polishing it right now, but I think we're actually gonna go with that now We do have those rally wheels and I'm curious maybe we can paint those I would assume that we can but I've seen videos of other people driving around with the rally wheels and I didn't see them paint it, so... I don't know, I really hope we can, but... This doesn't look bad. Maybe we should change the color of the door, though. Maybe we should blend it in with the body since, uh... I don't know, this little two-tone thing we have going on here. It looks good in some ways and it looks terrible in others. 
Hmm, how does this go on? I'm assuming... Actually, do we need to have a back window? Let's see, there we go. Oh, <laughs> oh, that body damage. Okay, I think that just pops on. I don't see any bolts. Uh, maybe there's something down there, I don't know. I'll have to search around with the screwdriver or a little wrench. But yeah, that looks kind of cool. Okay, uh, does it really... No, it doesn't limit visibility out the back. That should be okay. All right, next part. Uh, let's see, we got the front bumper, rear bumper. Actually, that that's a bumper, right? Front spoiler, okay. You know what, do we have to rip the bumper off or can this just go on? Does this go on under it? Uh, let's see. Towing hook, no. Oh, it does. Okay, that's kind of neat looking. It's like more aerodynamics. Can we paint this bumper? Because it looks kind of weird because it's chrome and everything else is kind of like a, uh, a black color. Maybe we'll do like a flat black on it. Let's uh, paint this real quick. There we go, and can we paint you? Is that a paintable item, or are we painting the body here? Nope, guess not. Alright, let's see if we can get this wheel off here. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> Alright, bye you hunk of crap wheels. We're gonna chunk you uh, kinda in the trash. Okay, let's see what these sweet new wheels look like on the car. Uh, are we... Uh, I think we're falling off the jack. Come on, jack. Oh, don't fail me now. I've already got plenty of dents in the car. I don't need a couple more. It looks like we are barely hanging on it. Why can't we... Why can't we put this on? Come on, Will. Did I got the wrong one here? Oh, jeez. Are you... You're, you're kidding me, right? Am I really mixing these up again? People are going to think I don't know my left from my right. Okay, this should come on now. Come on. Uh, oh, there we go. Okay, so I'm assuming we have to tighten... Kind of like we took them off here, so we got four nuts, and then we got that center nut. So I'm going to hit the rest of these wheels here. Now, I'm having a little bit of problems with one body part. I have this rear spoiler thing that goes on the bottom, and I don't know if I can't get it on because of the uh, racing exhaust is not on yet, or what it is, but it does not want to slot in at all. So, I don't know, I'm about to figure out what I'm doing wrong there, but... Anyways, let's go ahead and get all four of these wheels on, and then we're going to start shedding some weight, too, on the car and make this thing light as possible. Apparently, it's food time. We'll just eat the sausage that's been setting out. Eat that. Grab another beer here. Now, okay, I've got all the wheels on, so we've got that going for us. Now, it is time to shed some weight here. That was a nice belch. Okay, so we're going to get our spanner out, and if I can get low enough here, come on. What are you doing, guy? There we go. Okay, so we're going to unscrew this. Wow, was this seat already unscrewed? It's weird because I reset the game. Uh, I had to go save it and all that, and I guess it is out. Is it the seat not even in here anymore? The seat was leaned forward earlier because it was damaged, but I thought it was like it reset itself or something, but apparently it's already... Yeah, it's unscrewed already. Okay, that doesn't seem safe. Uh, come on. Oh, you know what you can do? I didn't know you could do that. Okay, you need to get out. Come on, seat. Come on, I don't need to recline you or anything. I need you out of the car. Out of the car. Come on, get out of the car. Oh, uh, you're gonna make this difficult seat, aren't you? I don't get it. I can remove the back seat with ease, but this front seat, I've already checked all the bolts again. It will not remove one bit. Like, come on. Like, I'm pretty sure this is a removable item. Maybe it isn't after a while. I don't know, I could have swore I've seen people without it. So maybe we need to run this into something because it's completely unbolted. So we're gonna we're gonna place that back. Well, we did shed some weight, but I know we can get rid of even more. Does that lead straight back into our trunk now? That's gonna be kind of odd. Oh well, looks like we got a little bit of extra trunk space. So yeah, I've got to get that seat out somehow. I don't know. I'll have to figure out what what's wrong there. So we've got that. Let's close that. Now this little doohickey here, we're still gonna have to work with it because it doesn't want to go on either. So I think we're ready to pull this in. Oh, you know what? We're gonna stick this sweet thing on. Look at that. That is a, uh, it's a racing wheel, I think. Alright, here comes this piece of crap. There we go. Oh, <laughs> okay, that just falls off. Now, question is, is this racing wheel, is this one of the ones that just pops on and off? Or, I don't know, I don't see, like, a screw. Uh, let's see if this will just go right on here. Come on. There we go. Oh, okay, that's kind of weird. The screw just kind of goes through, so... Anyways, get that screw down there. Man, I really wish I would have ordered those gauges. The inside of this would look so cool. Uh, if I can do that, and if I can get rid of this stupid seat to my side, I'll be a happy camper here. 
So yeah, let's uh, get this thing into the garage real quick and we're gonna do a little bit of working under the hood and hopefully we can get some of these parts in and then we might even try to get the exhaust on too. All right, we are working in the hood here. Now, I don't know, I'm looking at this carburetor and this uh, these headers. I don't know if I'm gonna get those on yet. I'm gonna have to look at how to actually do those. I'm a little confused by looking at the parts, but I know I can get this radiator in. So we'll have basically everything installed except for probably those two things. Now let's go ahead and unscrew those. I've already removed the hoses here. I thought there was a third hose. Did I completely miss it? Let's see, it's one, two, there's all the screws I believe that are in the radiator. There's one hose there that's gone, one hose down there. Wasn't there a number three somewhere? I don't know, let's see if we can rip it out here. Will you come out? There we go. Okay, so radiator is out. There's this old hunk of crap. We'll just toss that up there on the shelf. Okay, new radiator. Let's see. I'm assuming same mounts. One, two, three, four. Uh, same hose placement. No, it looks like the hoses. No, I actually think they are in the same spot. Could have sworn there was a third one. Uh, maybe not. Uh, oh, oh, we already had the check mark. There it is. Oh, look at that. That looks awesome. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and screw that in there. That's gonna be four screws on this one, and then we're gonna grab those hoses and attach them uh, to the side here. So we're gonna fill this bad boy up and then we're gonna go under the car and try to undo the exhaust because we have that racing exhaust we can put on and then maybe we can put that back panel on or the uh, then they call it the rear spoiler and is this thing did it again this hood when did that happen I swear this thing's like it's destroying itself whenever I exit the game that's a little strange there I don't know that's a little fishy I don't recall doing anything uh, come on come on there we go Full there, we're gonna stick the cap back on that, and then we're gonna go under this car and try to pull out this uh, exhaust, and yeah, that bugs me. What happens when we shut this? You are kidding me. Maybe we can hit that with the hammer and knock it out. One, let's see, where's two at? Where are you at, buddy? Ah, uh, there we go, there's actually three on this, so that should take care of that part. And then I need to rip off the actual muffler itself. Come on, there we go. Oh, there. Oh, okay. Well, that came off kind of abrupt. Okay, we need to get you off, Muffler. I think you might be a... Is it a six? Or maybe it's an eight. I don't know. Uh, that looks a little smaller. Let's try a six here and see what happens. There it is. All right, let's get this unbolted. All right, exhaust. Here we go. And click. All right, racing exhaust is on. I'm still having a problem with that muffler. It does not want to come off at all. Uh, let's see. It's, I'm assuming these are still seven. So yeah, we got two screws up here and then there's like a support brace towards the back and oh, you know what? This isn't even lining up with headers. Okay, so still headers are going to need to be on. Yeah, we'll just get this bolted down. This shouldn't affect it and then we'll just stick those uh, as soon as I figure out how to install them. We'll get the headers on and get the uh, twin carburetor on. Uh, let's see, there's one here and one here. And then I think that's going to be it as far as performance parts. There really isn't anything else you can put on. All right, that is on there. That looks good. Okay. So yeah, really the only thing we have left to do, we need to get the twin carburetor on, the headers. Uh, that thing does not want to pop on. I don't know what's really wrong with that. I, I figure that goes over the exhaust, but I still cannot get it on for whatever reason. So we'll have to figure that out. But for the most part, we are through with performance parts and I'm starting to move slow. I think I'm getting tired. But anyways, guys, yeah, we'll finish this up. We'll do some racing. Uh, comment below what you want to see me do next. Uh, maybe even comment about that paint job because I would like to get this thing possibly painted. It's a little expensive, but we'll have to see what happens there. But anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's episode. I know it was a little bit more of a building episode, but it was a very necessary step into getting into our racing career. But anyways, guys, if you like to like and subscribe, everything helps my channel, and we will see you guys next time on My Summer Car. Thank you.